Hello and welcome back to my PaintShop Pro X6 tutorials. So in this tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to use the eraser and by using the eraser you'll be able to remove areas on an image. So the eraser tool is just down here on the left hand side on the toolbar. If you can't see it then it may be because you've got the background eraser selected so you just need to click on that drop down arrow and click eraser. So once you've got your eraser loaded you'll see that there's a few selections over the top here. Now if you click on this drop down menu here you'll see that you can choose the size and the shape of your eraser. So you can choose round ones, square ones and then different sizes. So I'm just going to choose the round 50 one. And this is a preset tool and you'll see that it's changed all of these here. So you can change these manually by using the drop down arrow and then choosing your own selection here. So this is the size, so the further to the right you put your slider, the bigger your eraser will be, as you can see there. This is the hardness, now you'll notice that when I left click here, that it's not got a very sharp edge, it's quite a smooth edge. And if you have this a lot higher, you'll have a much sharper edge. So you can now see that that is a sharp edge on there. If I was to drop this right down, you would see that when I left click, it's very soft and it gently fades into the rest of the image. So I'm going to now remove the majority of this apple from the image. So I'm going to choose a suitable size and a suitable hardness. So it doesn't have to be too hard, but I don't want it to be too soft. So I'm just going to have it just over halfway and then I'm going to pick a size which is pretty much the same size of the fruit. So now I'm happy with that, I can left click and then you can just keep clicking and you can remove sections of the image at a time. Now if you had this set as a much harder setting then it would remove it all at once but I would like to blend my removal into the rest of the photo. So I'm just going to keep clicking and removing little segments at a time. So you can see that's the majority of the round section removed. I'm now going to drop down the size to a smaller amount to try and fit it with the stem there. So I need to go a lot further down. And that's almost right. I'm going to also increase the hardness. And now when I left click, you'll see that it's removing the stem. So obviously you would have a purpose of removing something from an image, but this has shown you the basics of using the eraser tool in PaintShop Pro X6. So if you've got any requests for videos in the future, or any questions for how to use this software, then please do feel free to comment below. And as usual, I'll see you in the next video.